Developing tonight, Governor Kemp has signed the amended 2021 state budget. It includes a million dollars for marketing to help boost the state's tourism industry, and it also restores some of the cuts made last year, with about $600 million going back to the state's public schools. This balanced budget funds our priorities and sets our state on a clear path to a strong recovery in the coming month. But the most talked about aspect of the new budget is the nearly $60 million that state leaders included to give bonuses to almost all state employees. The $1,000 payment will only go to those who make less than $80,000 a year. Now, not everyone is happy about that part of the budget. One of them is a former employee of the University System of Georgia. She says she lost her job last year because of the state cuts during the pandemic. As Fox 5's Elizabeth Rollins reports, she says she's lost everything and is now weighing in on the thousands of state employees expecting a bonus. The coronavirus recovery efforts are underway in Georgia as federal and state lawmakers attempt to stimulate the economy and help those who have been laid off. This week, Governor Kemp signed the amended fiscal year 2021 budget, which included giving 57,000 state employees a bonus. This includes K-12 public school educators and staff. This comes just six months after the state mandated that all 26 public colleges and universities make cuts, including layoffs and furloughs. I just don't understand how they can now turn around and get these bonuses. Fox 5 speaking to a former business manager at Kennesaw State University. Per blindsided. I had worked eight years and had 15 minutes on a Zoom call to clean my office out and leave. She says she was nearly two years away from retiring when she found out last fall that she was being let go. That's what I don't get. I, that, was, that was the first thing I asked her in the Zoom interview was, what about my seniority? She, she said it didn't go by seniority. So what did it go by? How much money I was making? Even though she wasn't a K through 12 public school educator, she was a state employee with the University System of Georgia, which recently announced they would honor the same $1,000 bonus to all of their employees. To see this now that they're matching $1,000 because that's what the governor's doing, it, it's not a very good feeling at all. I'm Elizabeth Rollins reporting at Kennesaw State University's night, Fox 5 News. The University System of Georgia sent us a statement that reads in part, since last fall, the state's fiscal outlook has improved dramatically. With declining state revenues, the University System of Georgia experienced budget reductions along with most other state agencies due to the COVID-19 pandemic. This year, USG received new state and federal funding, which we did not anticipate.